the 9th Reconnaissance Wing has been a part of the 12th Air Force on and off since 1993. But with the official stand-up of the 25th Air Force on September 29th, things are changing. The 25th is a new numbered Air Force with a focus on operations dealing with intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, or ISR. At the center of the new NAF is what used to be the Air Force ISR Agency. But with this new reorganization, the 9th Reconnaissance Wing enters the fold. Most members of Team Beale won't even notice the change, and operations will continue as normal. The new 25th Air Force Commander, Major General John Shanahan, stopped by the base for four days to become more familiar with Beale Air Force Base and find out what the 9th Reconnaissance Wing has to offer. The goal of his visit was to get educated on all things Beale, who we are, what we do, and how we do it. I couldn't be more excited to have Beale and the 9th Reconnaissance Wing part of, of 25th Air Force. I've looked at this for many years as how could we bring all of this together? Hey, we integrate together every day. Why not put us all together under one organization, one numbered Air Force? One of his first stops was the 9th Physiological Support Squadron, where he was fitted for his own flight suit and taken to the altitude chamber to prepare him for his upcoming high flight. He was able to experience firsthand what the average U-2 pilot goes through before ever getting in the cockpit. Within the same day, General Shanahan was escorted by members of the 9th Security Forces Squadron, along with Colonel Doug Lee and Chief Master Sergeant Leslie Gould, around the perimeter of the base to get a good look at the 23,000 acres that Beale covers. Everything from riding an ATV to eating breakfast, lunch, and dinner at various places across the base, to visiting the medical group, to the physiological support training and preparation for my high flight, and so much more. I've just really been, been impressed by uh, the people and the missions that I've seen. Along with speaking to each of Team Beale's squadron commanders, General Shanahan took time to get to know fellow airmen and share a bit about himself as well. He provided advice for airmen. For any airmen out there, I tell you, find a balance. Work very hard at doing it. It gets harder and harder. And if you're not careful, you'll be out of balance between work and family. His own perspective on the world of sports. I did grow up in New England. I do have a, uh, I still have my heart in, uh, in New England Patriots, Boston Red Sox, the Celtics. Now I've lived in Washington, D.C. for a couple of times, so the Nationals are my second favorite baseball team. And even what he listens to when he works out. I'm a shuffle sort of person. I'm a mix. I'll listen to everything from Lily Allen to classical to rock and roll to bluegrass in between. General Shanahan's visit concluded with his U-2 high flight on Friday and Beale's own Air Force ball on Saturday. The successful trip gave him a look at what Team Beale and the 9th Reconnaissance Wing will bring to the new 25th Air Force, as well as putting faces to the name. Reporting from Beale Air Force Base, California, I'm Airman First Class Benjamin Buganig.